It turns out David Cassidy, the Partridge family icon who died last month, I wasn't very close to his actor daughter, Katie Cassidy, because he left her nothing in his will. Cassidy died November 21, aged 67, after being admitted to the hospital with liver and kidney failure. The actor and singer was survived by daughter Katie, 31, who was born out of a relationship with model Sherry Williams and son Bo Cassidy, 26, whose mother is Cassidy's third wife, Sue Schifrin. The Blast reported Wednesday that the star specifically chose not to include Katie, who stars in the hit CW show Arrow, in his will, leaving all of his assets to his son, Bo. It is my specific intent not to provide any benefits here under to Catherine Evelyn Cassidy and or any descendant of Catherine Evelyn Cassidy, he said in the will, which was reportedly written in 2004. The website added that Cassidy had about $150,000 in assets at the time of his death, all of which will go to bow. Cassidy's wealth was depleted in 2015 when he filed for bankruptcy, declaring debt of up to $10 million. In February, Cassidy, who battled dementia before his death, told people he was estranged from his daughter, who also appeared on the TV show Gossip Girl. I've never had a relationship with her, he said. I wasn't her father. I was her biological father, but I didn't raise her. She has a completely different life. Though they were never close, Cassidy said he was proud of the career his daughter's Hollywood career. She's very talented. It's hard for me to even accept how old she is now, like 30, he said. In a tweet after her father's passing, Katie Cassidy thanked fans for their well wishes and also revealed that Cassidy's final words were, so much wasted time. Katie also appeared on an episode of The Celebrity Apprentice to support her dad in 2011 when he was a competitor.